Grit Daily would like to welcome you to Monday Motivation. Hey there, everyone. How did you like that fabulous new intro by Touch Circle? Pretty amazing. Kind of gets you really pumped up. And I'm so glad you're here because we're welcoming summer. And what does that mean? Well, it means we've got to do a few things. I mean, number one, we've got to get outside because that's probably the most important thing that we can do to improve our health. Just get out there, feel those sunbeams, feel that radiant energy, enjoy all of the sounds of summer, the birds, the waves if you're at the beach. It's just an absolutely fabulous time of year. Perfect to get out there and exercise, perfect to get out there and socialize, but of course, Got to do it with a little social distancing. Got to be safe. Keep up your hand hygiene, wear a mask, and keep that distance of six feet or more in order to try to stay safe. Now, let's talk about some of the tips on how you can have a healthier summer. Well, number one, everybody knows it that you want to stay cool, but it's really that extreme heat that you've got to watch out for. So monitor the weather. Look for those high heat index warnings. The combination of high humidity and high temperatures can like, well, pretty much wreak havoc on your personal health. So think about putting a cold compress on the back of your neck and use your wrists up against your drinks, which uh, if you have them iced, it's really kind of a nice thing. Helps you cool down fairly quickly. Of course, wearing a hat with a wide brim can also help keep your head cool. Tip number two. Tip number two. Avoid those heat peaks. Yep, I know you want to get out there, you want to exercise, but don't do it at high noon. That just doesn't make sense. Try to go earlier in the day or even later in the afternoon, early evening, when you can still get all of the benefits of that vitamin D and sunshine, but you're not risking going out in the highest heat of the day. Tip number three, hydration. It's all about rethinking what you're drinking. And that means drinking a lot of water. If you are drinking alcoholic beverages, well, more power to you. Have fun with that. Just A, don't swim while you're drinking because you don't want to swim and be under the influence. And the second thing is for every alcoholic drink that you have, alternate with a glass of water. And if you're not drinking alcoholic beverages, try to minimize the sugary drinks like sodas and juices because they can really help actually dehydrate you. So think about water, bubbly water, and all kinds of stuff first, that you're gonna be out there and enjoy your summer. Get those vitamin D levels boosted way, way, way up there. Have a great one. Follow us at Grit Daily on social media and listen to all of our podcasts, including Like a Boss on Spotify, Apple, iHeartRadio, or your favorite platform. For special guest submissions, email lauralynn at gritdaily.com.